Today we're going to do a comparison on the different types of panel insertion methods there are on greenhouses um, within the Australian market. The most common one you'll find these days is the slotted channel method, where your panels slide into the slots within the greenhouse frame. Um, most greenhouse, greenhouses use this method and they have an 8mm deep channel. Um, that's generally what you find. Maximum you'll get 10mm. These are actually a 10mm channel. So we, today we're just going to set this one up as an example and we're just going to load some weights across it and we'll just see how much weight it can actually take before it fails. Um, also we're going to show you our, our strip locking method uh, which we believe to be the strongest on the Australian market. We'll also load this one up with weights as well and we'll just demonstrate how much weight this one can actually take. So just to show you here, just measure the width between the panel. So that's 720 wide. Okay, that's our, our uh, strip block method. Also, we'll measure between the, the bay here on the slotted channel method and you'll notice it's, say, 710 wide. Okay, so today we're going to just load up some weights on it and we'll see how much weight it can actually take. So we're going to start with some 5 kilo weights. Okay, so we'll just load them up. Okay, so 5 kilos. Go for 10 kilos. Okay. Try for 15 kilos. Twenty kilos. Okay, I've got some smaller weights, two point five kilo ones, so we've got twenty kilos on there, so another five kilos, twenty-five kilos. Again another five kilos, which makes it thirty kilos. That seems to be holding alright. Um, bear with me, I'll get some more weights. So we're going to put another 5 kilos on. Okay. So I think we got up to, what did we get up to around 35 kilos? And the panels fell out. Um, so yeah, you'll see there, slotted channels. Panels just slide in there. There's nothing actually holding your panels within the within the frame. They, your panels slide into the slot once they're in there. There's nothing actually attaching them there. There's other companies who stick a bit of rubber in there, or you know, rave on about other things they wedge into the pan into the slots. But it really doesn't make any difference. There's nothing actually holding your panel in there. So yeah, that's our first demonstration. Okay, we'll try our strip lock now. Okay, so we'll start off with the um, five kilo weights. Again, it's five kilos. Ten. Fifteen. Twenty. Two point five. Twenty five. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five kilos. Um, I'm actually out of weight, so I'm going to find something else we can pop on this. Give me a second. So as you can see, it's holding up quite well. Uh, this is a fifteen kilo bag of potting mix. We'll just pop on top. Still doesn't look like it's going to fail. Um, so what have we got? We've got 50 kilos on there. We'll have to find something out. Okay, we've got a garden rock. I'm guessing it's about 10 kilos. Let's pop that on also. Stays on. Um, yeah, I'll find some more. Okay, we've got a few more rocks. I guess this is about. 10, another 10 kilos we're going to pop on here. As you can see it's still holding very strong. 
Um, so you can imagine in high wind areas, this is why you definitely want to use our strip lock system. Um, it does incorporate silicon which is plopped down each channel, okay, just on the verticals. And then your strip lock will lock your panels to the frame. Okay, so we do have a lot of customers, you know, saying, well, I live in a high wind area, um, what, what method will I use? So we always recommend the strip lock system. Obviously, you can see here, it's going to take a lot more, more weight, pressure. The slider channel method, they're great for residential areas where there is a bit of shelter. Um, obviously, you know, in a built up residential area, you're not going to cop the full wind. So if you are on acreage or you just want to plonk it out in the middle of a paddock, you can't look past our strip lock and our bar capping systems as they are the best system on the Australian market and they're only used on the best greenhouses throughout the UK. Okay, so we do get a lot of phone calls from customers, you know, who are dubious of the use of silicon. They're often hesitant to buy um, a greenhouse using silicon and strip locking. Um, this is always due to the fact that they've been misinformed um, by a minority of uneducated greenhouse suppliers. There are suppliers out there within the Australian market, you know, they'll say our method is outdated and inferior. We believe it's not. In fact, it is the most advanced method out there to combat winds, strong winds and snow loads. Um, I think today we've proven that. As I said before, we are the only company in Australia who offer this fantastic method. Um, we've secured all rights to this method. Any individual who rubbishes this method, they obviously just haven't seen real quality and strength first hand. Just remember, it doesn't always pay to buy the cheapest greenhouse out there. Um, our strip lot method and bar capping, we know it's the best method. It, is, it does cost us considerably more to manufacture, but at the end of the day, you'll get the greenhouse you want and it will last you a lifetime.